No. All hail Dark Jar Jar. Hey guys, welcome back to another Mandalore episode. <laughs> and today we're on episode 7. Last time we saw bo get the Darksaber because she slayed the captive that slain Mando for about two seconds. Hey, got a little loopholes. Loopholes, it's the Elder Wand. <laughs> You killed Severus the one can up alone to me. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much. Uh, but today I am just curious if there's gonna be any more cameos after the last episode. We got Doc, we got Jack Black, we got Lizzo. So uh, they're just they're just throwing shit out there. Yeah. Uh I forgot my hack but me. Um so let's see what this episode is about. Full length Reactions on Patreon, link below. Share this video around so we can get into one of those compilations again. <laughs> and as always, play. Huh. <laughs> I know what happens. What yeah. planet doesn't have a breathable atmosphere? Space. <laughs> Space is a planet. Like, like there's only like one time in the history of Star Wars where they needed a gas mask to for the planet they were on. Other than that, any other planet or moon is habitable. Yeah. What's going on on Coruscant? Did my boy speak? <laughs> I've been seeing a lot more chorus on these days. Yeah. It's just that one trench. Looks like it from the back of the head. It is. Yes. God, it's your favorite asshole. Oh, what the fuck is she up to? So. Who is she communicating with? Of course. And make it quick, as I am short on time. It's Sir, my boy. Run into trouble on Navarro. In your last report, didn't you suggest that the New Republic I would not you. be sending support? It wasn't the New Republic. Magistrate Cargo was aided by Mandalorians. Which Mandalorians? According to the reports received by the New Republic. Bo-Katan Kreeze led a squadron of Mandalorians alongside Din Djarin and his cohort. This cannot be. Those two factions are sworn enemies. Which is why I contacted you with haste. Not anymore. Thank you. Yeah. Continue with your mission. This I is the way. <laughs> you haven't seen the last of me. What are you working on this season, Mom? Oh, these motherfuckers. What you got cooking? First it was Dark Troopers. That didn't work. Yeah, troopers are those. Those clones. The Republic is vulnerable, but we must be cautious. We show no sign of our true strength. Captain, the race must not be wasted. The Grand Admiral Thrawn's return will herald in the reemergence of our world. Yes. Is so he going to show up in here too? Please. I need. Captain Talion, you always speak with much authority. And yet I see, once again, that Grand Admiral Thrawn is missing. Space balls just don't work. Space balls. <laughs> Watch out. <laughs> Not again. Tight magic strength. It is here 
imperial shuttle is advancing over the city. Do they want to drink here too? Yeah. <laughs> First, I have a light cruiser, and second, it's not imperial. With apologies, according to my data, it is. No, no, it was an imperial ship. Look at the markings. See those, my friend, Man, Mandalorian privateers. <laughs> I'll bet you half that fleet was captured from the Empire. So, they're on our side then? I should hope so. There are... <laughs> they're here like, we're the only cult. Giant ships go over their heads. <laughs> They've never met. And what little they know of each other, they hate. They will if they want to survive. Now enter the Baptist realm, Mandalorian. <laughs> what a big map. Play nice now. I know you always got something to say, but play nice. Alright, they have their helmets on, smart choice. <laughs> Yes, he lives. Welcome back, buddy. Are you possessed or not? <laughs> Babu. <laughs> hey, hey. What did you do to IG-11? Oh, that's IG-12 now. Do you like him? Do I like him? Don't worry. He's safe. You're sure? Well, the Encelon stripped IG down to his base motor functions. They removed his memory circuit. The pilot provides cognition. Yes. <laughs> you want to pass in a fight? <laughs> Think of it this way. It's more like a vehicle. It's safer that way. <laughs> Well, <laughs> he's too little to operate this. No, 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 no. But let's see if he fits. Ready to fly your first car? <laughs> <laughs> Baby, you know, that's now an assassin joint. <laughs> New cosplay right there. Uh -huh. So what do you think? They do nice work, I'll give them that, but Grogu is too young to operate heavy machinery. Maybe when he's older. No. <laughs> what do you mean, no? No. <laughs> he's saying he's old enough to operate it. Yes. <laughs> Get him out of there. No. <laughs> well, at least let him try it out in my office. Yes. <laughs> no. <laughs> Come on. It's first word. <laughs> hey. He's like, I want to try right now. <laughs> it's my new yep. toy. Almost busted the bust. <laughs> you look at that? Yes. Yes, what? Yes. 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 <laughs> yes. Yes. Best yes. yes. shit ever. Yes. He speaks. Yes. <laughs> yes. 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 <laughs> His whole yes. personality. Yes. <laughs> yes. 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 It's like giving a dog a squeaky toy. <laughs> what are you doing? Uh -oh. Stop. Grogu. No. Get the paper. Yes, be the adult. I will go. Grogu as well. A volunteer's tribute. <laughs> <laughs> I will go. 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 
There you go. I will go as well. And I'll be damned. Anyone who stays behind is a pussy. Yeah. At that point. It's the only thing that's more Mandalorians than the Empire at this point. Possibly. Since they have, at least for, you know, the Mandalorians and the Convert, since they're never allowed to take off their helmet, they have children there, so it's assumed that they have done the do. What is it? How? How? What is it like? Never being able to take off your helmet, but doing the do. Like, what is that? Leave your thoughts below. <laughs> What is that experience like it's for like, them? It's like cosplay sex. <laughs> Just don't remove it, but we're gonna get it on. Imagine there's... it's hard to establish intimacy. Then we will side with you. Come on. Ooh, that is... Is it somebody we know? We have failed you, but our blasters remain in your service. <laughs> hey, let's go. Yo, that actor looks familiar. I don't know where I've seen him before, but he looks familiar. Oh, that's a welcome party. They bombed ever since twice over. They punished us. It's a warning to the whole galaxy. Sounds about right. Yeah. That's not true. Impossible. I did surrender. <laughs> Bullshit. After our forces were annihilated in the Night of a Thousand Tears, and defeat was imminent. I met with Moff Gideon. The ISB had reached out to me to negotiate a ceasefire. In exchange for submitting to the Empire and disarming, all remaining cities in Mandalorian lives were to be spared. That's how he got the Darksaber. That is how Moff Gideon came to possess the Darksaber. Okay. He didn't want it. He didn't win it. I didn't trust him, but it was the only chance I had to save our people. And then he betrayed me, and we were helpless to resist the purge of Mandalore. How did we better survive? We were hidden on the moon of Concordia. Were you Death Watch? Death Watch exists no longer. It shattered into many warring factions. Our people have suffered time and again from division and squabbling factions. Survived. I don't know if I can keep everyone together. There's well, too much animosity. With Din on your side, you can't. And this blade Maybe. is all I have to unify our people. They're all adults. It shouldn't be your sole responsibility. You to be honest, it means nothing to me or my people. Nor does station or bloodline. What means more to me is honor. And loyalty. Damn right. And character. These are the reasons I serve you, Lady Kreese. Your song is not yet written. I will serve you until it is... See, why can't every politician be like Din Djarin? I'm with loyalty and honesty. Because I don't care if you have a weapon of power. Because not all politicians, but the vast majority are fucking snakes and deceitful 
flying ship bags that only serve themselves and no. We'll rest tonight and continue at first light. These here are too weak to continue. We must return to the gauntlet and I will ferry them back to the fleet in the morning. Agreed. Captain. Those of you who are well enough can join us in the search for the Great Forge. We can do better than that. We can bring you there. Nice. <laughs> So we've lived on in this planet for Onward, years. We can, we can take you. Yeah. I'm really glad they're over the whole wearing your helmet thing. <laughs> the fact that Dick got separated from Mandalore in a Boba Fett episode. What the hell is that? It's the Flying Dutchman! Oh. There's always a giant monster. There's always a bigger fish. What the hell is this? What in the Zillow Beast is this? Imagine it's a live action scene. Oh my god, I was kidding! It's a Zillow beast. Not quite. Wait, no, it's not. Hang on. Is it just a dragon? <laughs> is it Khaleesi? It's... I don't know what it is. Better get out of there. Get the hell out of here. There are like quite a few men just died from that. Yeah. You don't want to mess with something like five times your size now. You can let this thing just be in here. Just fly. You gotta toss a bomb in its mouth. We never left. Survived by migrating along the surface till the war ended. Some tried to explore below, but none survived. The ones who were low. Yes. Oh boy. Imperial. We got some stormtroopers. They fly now. Oh, they upgraded. They finally upgraded their armor. It only took five years. Those are people or droids, because they're moving like androids a little bit. Yeah. Okay, I hear screaming. Never mind. Or where that came from. Oh shit, yeah, that's all their that's all their ships though. They weren't pushing them back there. Trap. 
trip. Damn it. I had hope. I had hope they were falling back. And then I lost hope. Of course things were going too well. Oh shit, is Ding gonna get captured this time? Is Grover gonna have to save him this season? This isn't how things are supposed to go. I swear, if they remove his helmet, I'm gonna be salty. Ooh, is that Gideon? <laughs> Dark Trooper. Is that... Hang on, is that Thrawn? Hang on, hang on. I want, I want to know. I want to know if that's Thrawn or Gideon. Okay, okay. damn it. I'll... Well, you know what? A. Hey. Thank you for gathering the Mandalorians into one place. You were a talented leader, but your time has passed. However, as you can see, Mandalore will live on in me. Thanks to your planet's rich resources, I have created the next generation Dark Trooper suit, forged from Beskar Alex. That's the smartest thing the Empire's ever done. <laughs> And the most impressive improvement is that it has me in it. <laughs> you see, every society has something to offer. The cloners, the Jedi, and even the Mandalorian. By aggregating the best of each, I will create an army that will bring order to the galaxy. The First Order? Why don't we take your fleet off the board? While we still have the element of surprise, activate the interceptors and bombers. No! Get the hell out of there! Well, shit. I knew things were going too goddamn well. That's how it always goes. Well, one good visitor, come on. <laughs> Take them all, yes. He's a dad, he can't die. He has attachments, therefore. Although he's di this is Disney and he's a parent, so it's very likely <laughs> that he could die. Because Disney has a fixation on parents or grandparents dying. No! There are too many. No! This is the way. No, you asshole. I, li I knew I liked you. As soon as you start liking a character in Star Wars. You're my favorite one, John Bevro, no. He better live. He's machine taking gun. him out. His machine gun's about to overheat. Throw that at him. Throw it at him. Yeah. <laughs> he ain't going down. He's the wrecker of the Mandalorians. <laughs> Go down like a boss. <laughs> I love this guy. <laughs> he, he lit, he made it. Come on. It's still early. Just don't explode. We getting a duel? Come on. Ooh. We getting a duel? This guy, this guy is tougher than Din, okay? <laughs> Let's go. He is like eight feet tall. <laughs> Damn it. Come on, you got it. You can do it. Ah. You're too cool. Or is this the whole season? <laughs> Damn it. Ragnar is not gonna be happy. Still with his helmet on though. Yeah. He went out like a boss though. I'll give it to him. I'll get it. Give it to him. The moment he actually started to be cool is when he died. As is the way. Fuck you, Rich. Damn. <laughs> I. That's a. He died, he died like a boss, but I want him to be alive. <laughs> I don't know, they were sticking their things inside of him. I know that could mean a lot of different things, but you know. 
You know what? He he didn't he he still has his helmet on, therefore he's alive. <laughs> I mean he's never taking it off, so Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I have smoked <laughs> He's like, I have not. He stands up next episode. I have not removed my helmet. This is the way. <laughs> uh, that was the best episode this season, hands down. Yeah, that was that was pretty good. I'm kind of shocked that now Grogu has to say Manu. It's always been the opposite way around, but now they have to say Din. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know how they're gonna save the fleet. They're gonna save Din. Well, either way, Bo still has the dark saber. Yeah, that's the one good thing that happened this whole mission. <laughs> For a second, I thought it was Thrawn in there, but then Gideon showed his face, and I'm like, okay. <laughs> yeah, I, was, I wasn't sure because it was like the helmet has horns. I don't know if it's reminiscent of Darth Maul, if it's somebody that was under Darth Maul when he was ruling or something. It's Darth Maul's leftover helmet he found in his garage. Yeah. <laughs> but I, honestly, uh, my theories are going wild now. I don't know if Grogu is going to... Is Grogu going to die trying to save Mando this season? Is Grogu going to not make it out this season? <laughs> I highly doubt that. Well, that was a dope-ass episode. Yeah. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Comment below, let us know you think new videos every week. Join us for our fan films and short films. Uh, full episodes on Patreon, link below, and get us in those compilations. Bye!